Uh, hi everyone, uh, today I have a subject that I want to test in the Tesla. I will go to a destination using full self drive, completely full self drive from A to Z. Then, in the way back, I will drive the car myself. The point is, I want to see if I use the full self drive, is the battery will be saved or if I drive it. So we will figure out today if the battery is better with full self drive or with us when we drive it. So stay tuned. So this is how Tesla show you the straight in the night. I mean, we are in the dark and everything is clear here, more than you can see in your eyes. It's just an incredible system, like, really hard. Um, all right, so right now I have uh, almost 42% in the battery. My destination is, as you can guys see, 45 miles and I supposed to arrive with 25%. So. I will turn the autopilot on in a bit after I get the highway and from that point I will keep with it until I arrive and um, let's be honest sometimes you need to disconnect the uh, or discharge the, the full self drive in some of the areas but I will keep most of the trip in full self drive uh, till I arrive then uh, then I will update you once we arrive how much this will keep 25% more or less then we will see so right now this is the full service drive one I'll see you know see you in the bit all right we arrived and actually I'm surprised that we arrived with a huge not a huge saving, but it's significant. It's 31%. Um, and the system that indicate to me that it will be 25%. So we saved 6% in the battery. <coughs> um, now I will charge the car and drive back to where I came from. Uh, I will keep the charging at 80% and from that point uh, I will drive back and see how much we will get um, if we drive back the 40 almost 40 uh, 45 mile then I will do the comparing between them so stay tuned um, I'm almost arrived to the destination where I drive from uh, and in this round I drive myself I didn't use the full self drive and we're already at 24% so actually now it's 23 so uh, yeah so it's clearly for me the full self drive save the battery um, probably my driving wasn't good maybe this is the reason why because I drive then I slow then I go fast then I slow um, but I didn't like I didn't go more than um, I don't I don't go faster than 75 mil per hour um, yeah so maybe is it the driving or maybe the weather getting a little, little more colder now. It's 49. I remember I drive it maybe like, I don't know if it was 49 or not, but maybe it's now colder. So yeah, um, 23. So technically the difference is um, 6% between them. Uh, and the destination was uh, 40 mile around 40 mile full self drive uh, save the battery how 
I don't know how, but maybe the Tesla system built to make full self drive better than driving in terms of uh, the energy. I'm assuming the system will indicate how far we will drive and from that point of view the energy will be adjust to uh, be spent or, 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 or used in less way than driving with no guidance. Well, I, right now I have a guidance. I, I, the system now where I'm going, but I'm still the driver here. So maybe that's the reason. Uh, not sure what's going on, but the difference I can tell for the drive save uh, the battery. Uh, more than uh, regular driving and this is about it thank you for watching and uh, subscribe follow me uh, for more experience uh, as this peace